And if you've had your phone on you at all this week, chances are you got a blue alert about this guy, Royce Wood. Now here's some background on him. Police say Wood is wanted for a home invasion on Saturday, and then he allegedly shot an officer in the leg during a traffic stop Sunday. Police have since canceled the alert, even though he's still not in custody. And now let's get to our Ariel Placencia. Ariel, not everyone is familiar with blue alerts. Yeah, that's right, Izzy. And you know, when the alert pops up on your phone, it doesn't even tell you what a blue alert is. So we'll talk about it tonight. And you know, they've actually been around since 2008. Blue alerts are basically sent out to kind of alert people about a person who's on the run who has suspected of killing or seriously injuring a law enforcement officer. Now, blue alerts, they do actually have to go through a couple of levels before they're ultimately approved and then sent out to your phone. It starts with the investigating agency, who then sends out a recommendation to DPS, who passes it along to the Division of Emergency Management. Then they send it to the mobile carriers who are part of FEMA's warning system. So it is very possible that you got alerts just like I did around Monday at 6.07 a.m., maybe Tuesday at 10.19 p.m., saying DPS issues a blue alert on behalf of Wise County Sheriff's Office for Royce Edward Wood. Now, if you look, both of these are basically exactly the same, just one day apart, and I got some clarification from DPS about that. So the original one was sent out just to the immediate area of Wise County. The second one statewide, so just basically expanding those notifications. Both of these were at the request of the Wise County Sheriff's Office. And yesterday afternoon, we found out that the blue alert was discontinued for Royce Wood. And I want to point out, he is still at large. He has not been captured yet, so remember that fact. But the Wise County Sheriff told me that they canceled it for two reasons. The first was they expanded the search even farther, and the second was that he was getting a lot of calls about people upset about the timing of these alerts. Some of the folks are complaining because it's waking them up in the middle of the night, and, and we hate that. We hate to cause any problems there. So here's what DPS says online that blue alerts can be sent out their notifications between 6 a.m. and 11 p.m. So again, if we look at back when I got them 607 a.m. 1019 p.m. That does fall in the range, but a lot of people kind of wondering, hey, these times are pretty close to when a lot of people are going to bed or they're asleep. I reach out to DPS and I'll let you know when I hear back.